Uh, Marvin, I guess, first of all, congratulations. You're staying for another three years. You must be quite pleased with that. Yeah, I'm delighted. Obviously, it's good to have some security in you know, another couple of years tied down as well. Uh, when you come in last season, you made a massive contribution. Um, first of all, with your four goals, but your overall performances were, the gaffer says, certainly a factor to... To Burton staying up, so this is this is your reward. Yeah, I mean, no, that's why I, I came here to to help the team stay up and and score some goals. And you know, I scored a, a couple of goals, but you know, in the end of the day, I helped the team stay up, and you know, it was a fantastic achievement for the club and everyone involved. So, you know, hopefully, we can do the same again next year. And, you know, kick on even more. And you made that step back up from League One to the Championship. You've you've played in the Premier League as well, but that seemed pretty seamless for you, coming from a lower division back into the higher division. How do you feel you got on? Um, I thought I did all right. I think there wasn't really much time to um, think about it, and because you know I came and and signed on the first and on the second, I think it was there was a game, so it. So it you know, I had to just adapt very quickly and just jump straight in and you know, I, I think I did okay. And now a chance to you to get a full pre-season under your belt with the gaffer so you can work together to to not work out a plan but now get get a bit more of an idea of how each other works if you didn't already last season. <laughs> yeah, I think you know, having spent the last six months at the club, I pretty much know how everything is but it would be good to get pre-season and, and you know, start the season quite strong as well which would be you know very helpful for us as well and, and your expectations um, not on a personal level but on a team level for next season what, what are you expecting from this team at least the same and you know that's you know, the minimum we want it, we want to achieve is to stay up but then we want to still be improving now everyone wants to improve all the time and you know we're no different so we'd like to you know push on as much as possible and if you look at the teams coming up from from the division below there, they have all been established championship clubs at some point um, in their history, so it's it's probably going to be a, a tougher championship season. Yeah, I mean, I, I, don't, I don't know if it's going to be any tougher than it was last season. I think regardless, it, the championship's going to be a tough league, you know, because there are big clubs from that had been Premier League uh, you know the old Division One giants and teams that have come down from lower who have settled and even gone on beyond the Championship into the Premier League. I think so. You know the names and stuff like we showed last season don't really mean anything. It just it's just another team that we have to face, and you know we're not scared of anyone or any any names.